Hey guys, Skeleton Blade here, and welcome back to Five Nights at Freddy's VR. So, I just bought this, and, well, I think we'll check it out later, but right now, I'm gonna pull the lever. Let's see what it does. What the fuck? Okay, you're much creepier. What's this? What is that? This is a secret area. Um. Oh, that scared me. Um. It's tapes. Hello? Can you hear me? Don't yes. exit this room, okay? This isn't a mistake. This room isn't a mistake. So it's a mistake. I had to hide these logs away from the core gameplay files in a place that only a beta tester would look and in a place where the files could be protected. Mm -hmm. I just really, really hope that the next development team finds this before the game is released to the public. Mm -hmm. This game has some kind of malicious code in it that we haven't been able to fully contain or even understand for that matter. We're over budget and out of time. But that's mm -hmm. not the reason that we're shutting down. Listen. I have to keep this short, so the file size will be small enough to fly under the radar. There are more. They may not be in order. Um... Okay. I saw it for the first time today. There was a character I couldn't make out who it was, standing at the end of the hall. I thought it was just bugged out, so I made a note of it and kept playing. But then it was looking in the window. And not like Chica or Bonnie would. It was like it was actually looking in the window, seeing what I was doing. I heard a pretty heated conversation this morning between Dale, our manager, and someone else on the line. It really feels like this project is in trouble. In no small part because of the lawsuit, I'm sure. There has to be a lawsuit. There's no way there isn't. It happened in this building just a few doors down from me. I think it's made worse by the fact that Jeremy tried to tell us something was wrong. But as a dev team, we all just saw it as a challenge to find what the problem was and fix it. Who could have known that? I have to go. Uh -huh. Have you ever heard of a guillotine paper slicer? It sounds made yes. up, but it's an actual piece of office equipment. I didn't even know we had one in the supply room. I guess the more common at businesses that do a lot of graphic design work. I remember seeing one when I was still in school, and even then, I knew how dangerous it looked. I was always afraid of losing a finger. That seems so silly now. Jeremy used to do design work. I guess that's how he knew it was there. That tape was useless. Okay, so I know what the tapes are for now. Um, but what's with the glitch guy showing up? Glitch guy, glitch bunny, glitch bunny. I doubt that is that, I doubt that's his name. So, let's check out, not night terrors. Vent repair parts and service, dark rooms, FNAF 3, FNAF 2, FNAF 1. Let's check out parts and service. See what that shit is. Okay, wait, that was probably really useful stuff. Welcome back shit. to parts and <gasps> service. Fucking motherfucker. Oh no, it looks like Bonnie's guitar is out of tune and must be recalibrated. Is First, it? we must access his harmonization module located inside his secondary oh, throat pipe. Fucking coin to access the throat pipe, oh. both eyes must first be removed. Looking for secrets. You must uh, be as precise as possible I when removing the eyes from their respective sockets. Looking First, firmly grip Bonnie's left eye and carefully remove it from its socket. Oh, I see a coin. Grab. Wait, what did you need me to do? Grab his eye? Great job. Deposit the left eye in, in the, the cleaning dark. receptacle on your- Well done. Now, Wait, firmly grip oh, Bonnie's okay. right eye and carefully it remove wrong. it from its socket. 
right eye. Deposit the That's right the eye, eye in the cleaning receptacle on your good job. Okay. To open Bonnie's faceplate, carefully press the two buttons located on either side of Bonnie's jaw. When done correctly, you should hear two small clicks. Anything else? Okay. Well done. <gasps> you now have access Fucking to Bonnie's harmonization module. Press the blinking God. button inside Bonnie's secondary throat pipe to enter calibration mode. I fucking hate you. Something is not right. One of those notes is out of tune. You may push the button again to replay the audio check. Press well, the I colored button any- that corresponds to the incorrect note. I didn't hear anything over you. Oh. Press the blinking button again to Vera. Great job. Bonnie is okay, in tune God. and ready for his solo. Let's close him up. Simply replace both eyes in the same order that you removed them, then close up the faceplate, and we'll call it a day. Wait, same order I removed them, starting with that one or that one? It said same order, so I'm gonna try this one. I didn't get jump scared. And close up the face. Well done. That concludes your parts and services task. See you next time. I fucking hate you. <laughs> that scared the hell out of me too. Okay. It's a sodi this time. Alright. Drink, drink, drink. Did I just eat the fucking soda? Okay, and I'm sorry I'm swearing so much, guys. I I just can't control it. Okay, bunny guy is gone. Okay, he's like a virus, like malware, and he's a bunny, so I'm gonna call him Malhair, just for now. Just until I find out his real name. Reminds me of Springtrap, though. Welcome back oh. to Parts and Service. Oh, why are you so close? There complaints about There's Chica's acrid here. smell. And Sounds tape. like Chica has been rummaging around the kitchen again. Remove all food particles from Chica's exterior and place it in the refuse bin on your right. Good job. Make sure Chica is not hiding any other treats inside her beak. To open her beak, carefully press the two buttons located on the sides of Chica's head. Wait, what the fuck is that? Do you guys see that? Did the fucking cupcake move? Okay, never mind. Um, I'm gonna guess oh, press these. It looks fucking like Chica bitch. has picked up some unwanted friends. To clear the infestation, apply the Fazbear what Entertainment Restaurant Grade Chemi Spray Ew. to Chica's exterior. Press the button I under the hanging the canister. Thing. Avoid inhaling oh. the chemi spray. Exposure to cleaning, disinfecting, and maintenance chemicals may result in respiratory problems, skin, or eye irritation. I'm blocking it. Now reattach Chica's upper arm, hand, and cupcake plate. It just fucking moved. It's fucking moving. Okay. Watch. Ah, see? Out of the corner of my eye. Well done. Oh no, it looks like Chica needs another See? dose of the chemi spray. Do not let the infestation spread. Be sure to give the canister button another push as needed. Return the cupcake okay. to Chica's plate. What? Wait, where is it? Please place the hey. cupcake on the plate. Where is that little fucker? <laughs> Fucking bitch. Well, I didn't know what I was doing. I hate you. Isn't his name Carl or something? Chad? I don't know. Welcome back to Parts okay. and Service. Okay, speed run. There have been customer <laughs> complaints about good job. Oh no. That it didn't scare me that time. Inhaling the chemi spray. Exposure to cleaning, disinfecting, and maintenance and chemicals may result in respiratory problems, skin, or eye. Well done. Oh no. It looks like Chica needs another dose of the chemi spray. Do not let the infest return the cupcake I, to Chica's place. I saw it that time. 
got you, bitch. Great job. Chica okay, is ready next. to serve pizza and hugs to the kids again. Take a complimentary slice of pizza for oh, a job well done. Oh, he's staring at me now. He's pissed. How about I feed Chica the pizza? Go on. Okay. Take it. Okay, give her another piece. Delicious. See you next time. Leave no pizza for you. Bitch. Okay. I really thought I was gonna get jump scared. I was afraid. Alright. I think that was food. Alright. We went to go. great lengths to create an authentic VR experience, Fucker. including using scanned photographs for reference and using original performance routines where applicable. Yeah, shut up. I need to go listen to this next tape. Okay. The drawers have been emptied out. Someone was here. Mm -hmm. I don't think it was spring cleaning either. No, mm -hmm. there was plastic on the floor. Someone was definitely here during the night. It had to have been the client. I mean, they sent us that stuff in the first place with no explanation, told us to scan it, said it would expedite the process so we wouldn't need to program any pathfinding ourselves. It was a budget thing, I guess. It was just junk. Circuit boards and things like that. Looked pretty old. Somehow, though, there was usable code on some of it. It seemed to take hold by itself. Things started changing. But then, he started appearing. At least that's what Jeremy said. Are you talking about the malhair? The virus? He's gone now. Um, I think I'm gonna do all of this just because. And I'm looking for tapes and shit too. So if I miss anything, well, you guys can't tell me because I'll have all of them pre-recorded. Welcome back to Parts and Service. Um, it looks like one of our guests left a personal item on our star attraction. Let's return it to the lost and found. Freddy's got a good job. Now place the hat in the lock. While we're at it, let's make sure there isn't anything else stuck inside. To access Freddy's chest cavity, grab Freddy's bow tie and pull it outwards. Well, there's a fucking thing. Whatever. Okay, I heard bow tie. Well done. Freddy's chest okay. cavity is now open. Remove the child's watch and place it in the lost and found bin. Fuck. I thought he said watch. Didn't he say watch, guys? Speaking of watch, I need to... Well... No, Welcome back to Parts and Service. Okay. Freddy's good Grab job. The hat. Now place the hat. While we're at it, well done. Freddy's chest cavity is now open. Remove the child's watch and place it in the yeah, lost he and said found watch. bench. Good job. It appears there is a child's shoe wedged behind Freddy's music box. Mm -hmm. The music box must be removed before you can access the child's shoe. Gently grab carefully, place the music box on the work table to great job. To reset the safety latch. Press the button located on Freddy's end of- Now, remove okay. the child's shoe and place it in the lost and found bin. Got it. Avoid the wiring. Well done. Return the music box to Freddy's chest cavity. <gasps> oh no! You seem to have mishandled Freddy's Shit. music box. I- I- this I- This is I, not good. Okay. A replacement may be found on the work do table. A replacement. A slow and even pace is recommended. Okay, okay, okay. Crisis averted. To close Freddy's chest cavity, press the large black button on the center of Freddy's face. Gotcha. That concludes What's your time behind parts and service. I your saw that. I saw it a little bit. I saw it. I fucking saw it, you... Mmm. Motherfucker. I saw it. <laughs> Knew it was there. Is that the mangle? Holy hell! What are you doing, Mangle? Oh, I'm looking for the kitties. I'm going to rip their faces off. Why do you want to rip kids' faces off? Because I'm an animatronic. That's what I do. Did I just fucking eat it? 
I just ate it. <laughs> what the hell? It seems that you may have okay. inadvertently accessed an unauthorized portion of the game. Please be nah. aware that interacting with unofficial game code can be harmful to you and potentially damaging to our reputation. Like the male hair? Okay, I'm gonna go listen to that other tape because, yeah. Okay, it's six. I came in early that morning. No one else was there. At least that's what I thought. The supply room was lit. I didn't even notice Jeremy standing in the testing room as I walked past. The supply hmm. room was so bright, glowing from all the way down the hall. Okay, that set up part of the story, but that was utterly useless. Um. Let's move on to Foxy, I guess. Welcome back to Parts and Service. Foxy has been out of commission for quite some time. This Eight. series of simple repairs should return him to full I got a hammer. condition. First, carefully pick up and place Foxy's head on his endoskeleton. Can I wear it? I can wear it. There's a coin here. Wait, what? Oh no. It looks like Foxy's chip, proprietary chip, chip, chip. servo motors are malfunctioning. It is recommended that you keep an eye on Foxy at all times. Um, you will need to place new control fuses in the exposed receptacles to continue. Retrieve the fuse from here. drawer number one that matches Foxy's leg receptacle. Did you say to one? To avoid bodily harm, oh. wait for Foxy's legs to yep. stop moving. Good job. Foxy has regained control of his legs. A gentle reminder, it is recommended that you keep an eye on Foxy at all times. Oh no. It looks like a former employee attempted to repair Foxy's chest motor using an incorrect fuse. And it's Carefully, poking out. remove the incorrect fuse from Foxy's chest and insert it into Foxy's upper arm. Well done. The remaining chest fuses are located in drawers number two and number four. Fix both fuses to continue. Blue, green, red. <laughs> Fuck. I got a hammer, Foxy. That was not scary at all. Maybe it would have been if he didn't do the running thing, but eh. I'm not Scott Coffin. Welcome back to parts of okay. Oh no. It looks like Foxy's proprietary servo motors are malfunctioning. It is recommended that you keep an eye on Foxy at all times. Good job. Foxy has regained control of his legs. A gentle reminder, it is rec- Fuck. I'll use the screwdriver this time. And the Foxy plush. <laughs> Fuck. Okay. Go away, Carl. I could listen to the tape, but I don't want to right back now. To parts. Oh no. It looks like Foxy's proprietary servo motor. What did I do that time? You guys saw I did nothing. Hmm. <laughs> And sorry I got jump scared so many times in this video, guys. It's stupid, I know. Welcome back to Parts and Service. But... Foxy has been out of commission for quite some time. This series of simple repairs oh, should return... Oh, no. It looks like Foxy's proprietary servo motors are melt. Good job. Foxy has regained control of his legs. A gentle reminder. It is recommended... Shit! Sorry, guys, you're probably disappointed in me. He 
You guys are probably really disappointed in me. I'm sorry. Welcome back to Parts and Service. Oh no, it looks like Foxy's proprietary servo motors are... Good job. Foxy has regained control of his legs. A gentle reminder, it is recommended that you keep it well done. The remaining chest fuses are located in drawers number two and number four. Fix both fuses to continue. Okay. What the fucking 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 fuck? Guys, are you counting how many times I got jump scared unfairly? Because it's a lot by now. Welcome back. Oh no. It looks like Foxy's proprietary servo motors are malfunctioning. Good job. Foxy has regained control of his legs. A gentle reminder, it is recommended that you keep an eye well done. The remaining chest fuses are located in drawers number two and number four. Fix both fuses to continue. Blue, green, blue. Good job. Retrieve Foxy's About eye from drawer time. number three. When Foxy's eye patch is fully open, place the eye back into his eye socket. Well done. This concludes all your parts and service tasks. Pirate Cove can now be reopened. I don't think it should be reopened. That was difficult as hell. It wasn't even worth it. Probably. Exotic beverage. I don't get it. And I ate the can too. <laughs> okay. Whatever. Are you having fun yet? That's no. great to hear. All right. On to the tapes. This episode is probably pretty long by now. Jeremy complained of nightmares when he came in this morning. He wasn't talking about it like someone telling fuck? a friend You're about in his here dreams, too. though. He was pale. Looked like he hadn't eaten in days. He spent an hour talking in Dale's office. But it didn't look like he was given much sympathy. When he came out, he went directly back to the testing room. He doesn't even jump anymore. Nothing scares him. He just stands there like he's talking to someone. Sometimes he rocks from side to side. We were told to leave him alone. I knew I was in line to do the testing next. They'd been prepping me for it. I guess they knew that Jeremy would need to be replaced soon. Damn, man. Okay, along with the 26, there's 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38. Why is that there? 39, 40, 41. So there's 41 total. What's this? Okay, I'm gonna look that up later, but... Right now, I'm gonna have to end the video because it's pretty long now, probably. Um, it's good so far. I got through parts and services. I'm gonna continue these next, I think. And if you guys like this, like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Let's hope that recorded correctly.